Advanced Fetal Heart Diagnosis is an internet-based program using segmental analysis to arrive at a diagnosis of congenital heart defects, CHDs. The full program is a guide to the diagnosis of 27 CHDs. Studies indicate that over half of such abnormalities are missed on screening exams. Segmental analysis is demonstrated for detransposition of the great vessels. This method is a way to methodically assess the fetal heart. All heart anomalies are based on three segments, the ventricles, the great arteries and the atria. Emphasis is upon anatomic connections. The first step is the ventricles and the AV valves. The second step is, how are the aorta and pulmonary arteries connected to the ventricles? Finally, the atria are considered and the systemic and pulmonary veins are assessed. The anatomic descriptions of the anatomy are then paired with potential differential diagnosis. In detransposition of the great vessels, the left and right ventricles are in their normal anatomic positions. The key to the diagnosis is from the left ventricular outflow tract view. On the left ventricular outflow tract view, there is branching of the great artery. The only great vessel which normally branches after exiting a ventricle is the pulmonary artery. The aorta does not branch. Therefore this vessel which is branching is the pulmonary artery rising from the left ventricle confirming the diagnosis. On the left image, the parallel great vessels can be appreciated. On the right images, these are subtle findings but the pulmonary artery from the left ventricle demonstrates some branching while the aorta from the right ventricle demonstrates head and neck vessels. Videos Left Detransposition the pulmonary artery rises from the left ventricle and the aorta arises from the right ventricle. Note the branching of the pulmonary artery and the parallel nature of the great arteries can be seen. Right video. The aorta is the non-branching vessel arising from the right ventricle. videos left detransposition note the parallel arrangement of the pulmonary artery and the aorta In summary, the left and right ventricles are in their normal anatomic positions. The best diagnostic clue comes from the left ventricular outflow tract. If there is branching of the great vessel from the left ventricle that vessel is the pulmonary artery and detransposition is the likely diagnosis. Confirmation then can be obtained from the right ventricular outflow tract which will show a non-branching great vessel. Detransposition may be associated with other cardiac malformations while non-cardiac abnormalities are less common. In addition, the specific heart defects can be viewed independently. The Advanced Fetal Heart Diagnosis Program offers over 200 pages of information, text, illustrations and videos and is accredited for 3 AMA Category 1 credits for physicians and sonographers. For further information see links at obimages.net.